What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Elder Scrolls 5 Skyrim video. This one we are going to be continuing on with the main storyline. More specifically we're going to be going to the Time Fracture or whatever it was called and read the Dragon Scroll, the Elder Scroll if you will, Dragon. Uh, that we got in the previous video, so what do you need, uh, we're gonna find out exactly how to use the brand new shout that we technically haven't even gotten yet, so should be pretty interesting to say the least. With that being said though, do me a huge, huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're already subscribed, because it really does help this channel grow. So, let's go ahead and get going. Alright, come on Jazargo and Mr. Wolfman thingy. I think it's over there at the top of the world. Oh, we got a level up too, so there's also that. Let's make sure we take care of that really quick. Level up. Absolutely. 2020, so we'll go with health. Can never go wrong with health, I suppose, right? Um Did we ever put into light armor? We did. Uh, custom fit. Uh, that's actually a good idea, actually. But let's see if we can put anything in, over here. Steady hand. Or we could go with quick shot. Actually, this is a big deal. We definitely need this. Alright. So now that that's taken care of, let's go ahead and... Uh, yep, it's over there at the throat of the world. Man, this is crazy. We're literally going to get a glimpse at the past. And not just like yesterday, but like forever ago, you know? You have it. The Kel. The Elder Scroll. Yes, ma'am. Tidkre. Kalos. Time shudders at its touch. There is no question. You are doom-driven. Kogan Akatosh. The very bones of the earth are at your disposal. Go then, fulfill your destiny. Take the scroll to the time wound. Do not delay. Alduin will be coming. He cannot miss the signs. Okay. Sounds good. So, we read it here? Do we have to do it in the inventory? Items, uh, scrolls maybe, um, I don't see it here, maybe books, um, where's the Elder Scroll, wouldn't it be here, or did I pass it, let's go back up, or perhaps it's in miscellaneous since... Oh, there it is. I see it. Oh, snap. Today, Alduin's lordship will be restored. But I honor your courage, Kreef Wolf Akrin. Die now in vain. Gasp! What's going on? Oh! Oh, it's a battle of the ages! They killed him. A glorious day, is it not? Have you no thought beyond the blooding of your blade? <laughs> what else is there? The battle below goes ill. If Aldun does not rise to our challenge, I fear all may be lost. You worry too much, brother. Victory will be ours. Why does Aldun hang back? We've staked everything on this plan of yours, old man. He will come. He cannot ignore our defiance. And why should he fear us, even now? 
We blooded him well. Four of his kin have fallen to my blade alone. None yet stood against Aldo and himself. Golfo, Sori, Birka. They did not have Dragonrend. Once we bring him down, I promise. I will have his head. You do not understand. Alduin cannot be slain like a lesser dragon. He is beyond our strength. Which is why I brought the Elder Scroll. Gasp! Feldir, we agreed not to use it. I never agreed. And if you are right, I no. will not need it. We will it. deal with Alduin ourselves. Hear it now. We shall see soon enough. Alduin approaches. So be it. Uh oh, SpaghettiOs. of course they killed the lady though worked we did it yes the world eater is gone may the spirits have mercy on our souls that's crazy oh snap he's here First things first, I need to put on Dragon Rend. Foods, you are too late. <laughs> Did I get him? Use Dragon Rend if you know it. I'm trying. Ah. Come on. Let's go. Here. Yeah, he is. Where is he? Is he gonna land or what? Die! Y'all die! Shoot to Zargo! I don't think I got him. Which means. Come on, give me, give me Dragon Ren back. There we go. Come on. Okay, I got him. Good. Crap, dude. 
You know what I should have done too? Put on some true shot. All right, we'll put on some true shot and where is my healing? Oh God. All right, let's go. Die! Aldemonian. Oh fuck, is Jazargo dead? No, he's not. No, that's not Alduin. Where's Alduin? Alright, I got him. But there's a problem. My health is really low. Ow. Let's hide. Fuck. I'm dead. Alright, I need he I need help. No! Come back here, Al Dominion. I'm pretty sure I didn't get him. Which means I need to chill for a second. Where is he? Is that Alduin? That's not Alduin. I don't see him. That's not Alduin. There he is. Sit your ass down, Al uh, Alduin. I'm scared. Where is he? There we go. Yes, he is. We're destroying him. Let's go. Leave me alone, damn it. Oh god, I'm pretty sure that was a uh, absolute atrocity. Alright, that's Alduin right there. I'm just now realizing there's a map marker on him. Ow! Where is he? Alduin, you need to sit your ass down, buddy. I hope Jazargo doesn't die. But I need another potion. Damn, dude, I'm literally using... Actually, you know what? I should put on resist fire. Come on. Where is he? There he is. Come on. Let's go. Nice try. Dude, I'm beating his ass right now. Literally, dude. That's his ass, and I'm beating it with my arrows. Hell yeah, boy! We just defeated him. You have become strong. But I am Al Duin, firstborn of Akatosh, Malagi Zoklat. I cannot be slain here by you or anyone else. You cannot prevail against me. I will outlast you, mortal. Haha, <laughs> nice try, buddy. Goodbye. Alright. Well, we gotta go talk to Esbern, it looks like. So, Esbern is way out here. If I could... There we go. Skyhaven Temple. Alduin was easy. If the final fight is that easy... I mean, we, we're good. Oh, I don't know why I looked in here. Wait, who is this right here? This is... Eric the Slayer. I'm, I'm proud of you. I pledge to rid Tamriel of dragons. This is it. Uh, this is a great adventure you're on, isn't it? I'm glad he finally has a purpose. 
By my honor, I pledge to rid Tamriel of dragons. Um. Cool. I'm a blade now. I hardly believe it. Nice. All right, but anyways, uh, where is uh? Doesn't look like he's in here. Wait a minute. All right. So he's gotta be out back. I hope at least, because then I'd be going outside for no reason whatsoever. But yeah, Alduin was freaking easy, man. I'm gonna need potions though, so I'm probably gonna end up going to like White Run or something, visiting one of the merchants and seeing if I could buy some. Hey, what's up, Fandal? Some potions. Oh, look at her. She's all dressed up now. Look at you. you look badass. What's up, Asburn? You still look like a bum. Did you find the Elder Scroll? What happened when you took it back to the throat of the world? Uh, I actually used it to defeat Alduin, but he escaped, unfortunately. I will find him, though, and I need to. He must have returned to Solengard to feed on the souls of the dead. If you don't find him soon, he'll return stronger than ever. I know. That's why I need to find him. Ah, yes, yes. We must think. He must have some means of traveling to and from Solengard. But no tale tells where that might be. Um. Well, you know what? His ally dragons should have some sort of an idea, right? Very true. I wonder, do you know the Jarl's Palace in White Run? Uh, of course. You mean, uh, Dragon's Reach, right? Yes, exactly. M most people don't know that it was originally built to hold a captive dragon. Hence its name. Got it. Makes sense, actually. Um, but I thought there was no dragons until Alduin came back. Oh, this was thousands of years ago. Before the Akaviri Crusaders cleansed Skyrim of dragons. Skyrim's mountains were still infested with dragons. One of the early Nord kings caught a dragon and kept it in Dragon's Reach. So if I could lure a dragon into Dragon's Reach, then I should be able to catch it, right? You could trap him there, exactly. Although, it might be difficult to persuade the Jarl to allow you to use his palace as a dragon trap. I'm sure you'll manage, though. If you can defeat the World Eater, surely sweet-talking the Jarl of Whiterun isn't beyond you. Yeah, he owes me I'm one anyway. a further problem, a serious one. I've discovered who the Greybeard's leader really is. What does that mean? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it turns out he's a dragon. But he helped me. All well and good. But did you know that he was Alduin's chief lieutenant in ancient times? Hmm? Responsible for terrible atrocities. It's true that his crimes are long in the past, but justice does not count the passage of years. The Blades have been hunting him for centuries, but he was protected by the Greybeards and then the Emperors. Justice demands that he die for his crimes. Until he is dead, I'm afraid my oath as a blade prevents me from offering you aid and comfort. Um. So where has Alduin gone? Haven't you been listening to me? All the old tales agree that he has some means to travel to Sovngarde itself. There, he devours the souls of the heroic dead. To feed his power, you must find his portal to Sovngarde before he returns stronger than ever. Uh, makes sense. All right. Goodbye, then. So, what do we have to do now, then? Kill Parthenax? Damn. All right. Well. Yeah, fuck it. Why not? <laughs> I'm down. Dude, dragon armor looks so sick, man. So, Parthenax, I'm sorry, but I gotta kill you, bro. Sit down. Alright. Hold on. I'm coming. I'm coming. Just chill out for a second, right? Drem your look. Greetings. So, uh, huh. Well, let's wait for that. Dragon's Reach was built to hold a dragon? Yes, this was ages ago, you understand. 
There were more of us then. Before the Bruniki, the Akaviri came and killed all my Zema. I used to visit him from time to time, nearly crazed by loneliness and captivity. Tiraz Sivaz. He did not even remember his own name. I do not know how he came to be caught, but the Bronyun, the Jarl, was very proud of his pet, Pak. The Hofkasayun has been known as Dragon's Reach ever since. Oh, well that's nice. Uh, so you're the master of the Greybeards. Do others come here to train? I have taught the way of the voice for centuries, and the Thum since long before that. But no, Dovahkiin. Others do not come here to train anymore. Saran, you are the first in over a hundred years. Gasp! I meditate on the Rotmulag, the words of power. I counsel in their use. It is enough for me. Uh, you meditate on the words? How? Knowing a word of power is to take its meaning into yourself. Contemplate the meaning of a Rotmulag. You will become closer to that word as it fills your inner self. Makes sense. Will I teach you, Dovakin? What word calls you to deeper understanding? There are three to master. Fus, Fime, and Yol. Um... I... I... sure. Fade in your tongue. Mortals have greater affinity for this word than the Dove. Everything mortal fades away in time. But the spirit remains. Ponder the meaning of spirit, Unslad Zi. Where mortal flesh may wither and die, the spirit endures. That is fine. Let that meaning fill you, Sum Ark Mora. You will find that your spirit will give you more strength. Um, so let's... Which calls to you, Let's see Dovat. what he says for the other one. It is called force in your tongue. But as you push the world, so does the world push back. Think of the way force may be applied effortlessly. Imagine but a whisper pushing aside all in its path. That is Fus. Let its meaning fill you. Sum Ark Mora. You will push the world harder than it pushes back. Cool. Let's Which see. Which calls to you, Dovakin? What the last one is. Fus, Faim, or Yol? Yol. In your tongue, the word simply Ooh. means fire. It is change given form, power at its most primal. That is the true meaning of Yol. Solyek, power, you have it, as do all Dove. But power is inert without action and choice. Think of this as the fire builds in your sum, in your breath. Sum Ark Mora. What will you burn? What will you spare? I like that actually. Uh. Alright, so the blades say you deserve to die. The blades are wise not to trust me. Onikan Niov. I would not trust another Dova. So why should they trust you? Dov Walan Farel, we were made to dominate. The will to power is in our blood. 
You feel it in yourself, do you not? I can be trusted. I know this, but they do not. Only Khan Niovdova. It is always wise to mistrust a Dova. I have overcome my nature only through meditation and long study of the way of the voice. No day goes by where I am not tempted to return to my inborn nature. Zimkriforvut se suyek. What is better? To be born good, or to overcome your evil nature through great effort? Okay. Sum Ark Mora. So, my whole thing is, he said it himself, every single day that passes by, he's tempted to go back. He also says that you shouldn't trust the Dova. And there's a lot of shady things about these the the freaking little priest up here. So I think I'm siding with the blades. Sorry, man. Sit down. Where is he? Sorry, man. You gotta die, though. You're gonna die, dude. And dead. I feel kind of bad, actually. <laughs> Let's see what he has. Gold, iron arrows. Not bad. Give me your soul, damn it. Let's go ahead and go talk to Delphine. What does this say? All right, let's talk to Delphine real quick before we actually progress with capturing a dragon or a Dova. Let's go. I wish we could recruit more than just three people to the uh, to the order of the blades. I like the blades, man. I've always liked the blades, even in Oblivion. All right, so where is she? Belle Delphine! Oh, Belle Delphine, I'm assuming you're on this side. In your little quarters, probably asleep, to be honest. Nope, just chilling. Who are you eating with? Dragonborn. Oh, nice. What do you need? No, I'm not talking to you, I'm talking to Delphine. We have nothing to talk about until Parthenax is dead. Look, you need to chill the fuck out, all right? Uh, so what do you have against the Greybeards? If they had their way, you do nothing but sit up on their mountain with them and talk to the sky or whatever it is they do. The Greybeards are so afraid of power that they won't use it. Think about it. Have they tried to stop the Civil War or done anything about Alduin? No. And they're afraid of you, of your power. Trust me, there is no need to be afraid. Think of Tiber Septim. Do you think he'd have founded the Empire if he'd listened to the Greybeards? Oh, you got a point there. Uh, well, about Parthenax. Have you decided to do the right thing, Dragonborn? I mean, I don't know if it's the right thing, but it's done. He's dead. I knew we could count on you. Glad to have you back on our side. I never left your side, girl. Chill the hell out. All right. Let's go. Come on, Jazargo. We got business to take care of. What's up, Vandal? By my honor. Shut up. Does he say anything? Yes. What is it? No. Let's go. Very good. Run! Oh god, now we gotta go catch a dragon. Bingo! This shouldn't be too difficult, to be honest. But I suppose we shall see. 
All right, so let's go ahead and fast travel to Dragon's Reach because we need to talk to the Jarl first, I believe. Uh, what does it say? Okay, well, I don't know. Let's just go. Look at those little chickens. They're just eating the most dangerous creatures in all of Skyrim because the second you shoot or, or accidentally kick one, you get attacked by every guard in the in the uh, province. No, not the province, in the uh, hold. All right, Yarl, I gotta talk to you, Broski. Gotta talk to you. Another wanderer. May the gods watch over friend. your battles, friend. So I kind of need your help, and the kind of help is probably something you're not gonna be 100% in favor of. I need to use your hold or your little place right here to trap a dragon. Uh, I must have misheard you. I thought you asked me to help you trap a dragon in my palace. No, no, you heard right. Uh, you know I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important, man. I'm sorry, but I can't do it. We'll just have to keep fighting the dragons as best we can. Look, I need your help to drag a pa uh, dragon. What you're asking for is insane. Impossible. You want me to let the dragon into the heart of my city with the threat <clears throat> of war on my doorstep? Exactly. Uh, it's the only way to stop the dragon attacks. There must be another way. The risk is too great. But it's not. The threat is worse than we know. Alduin has returned. Alduin? The world eater himself? Yup. But how can we fight him? Doesn't his return mean it's the end times? Uh, it's only hopeless if we give up, right? Plus, it's my destiny as Dragonborn to stop him. I don't know about such things, but I heard the Greybeard summon you. That's good enough for me. Now what's this nonsense about trapping a dragon in my palace? It's the only way to find Alduin before it's too late. We're at the brink. We gotta do this. I want to help you, Dragonborn. And I will. But I need your help first. Ulfric and General Tullius are both just waiting for me to make a wrong move. Do you think they will sit idle while a dragon is slaughtering my men and burning my city? No. I can't risk weakening the city while we are under the threat of enemy attack. I'm sorry. Um... What if you didn't have to worry about an enemy attack? Then... I would be glad to help you with your mad dragon trapping scheme, but getting both this. sides to agree to a truce will be difficult at this point. The bitterness has gone too deep. Maybe. Hmm. What of the Greybeards? They are respected by all Nords. High Hrothgar is neutral territory. If the Greybeards were willing to host a peace council, then maybe Ulfric and Tullius would have to listen. That's amazing. I've never done this before. Uh, leave that to me. I'll talk to Ardnir uh, about hosting a peaceful council. Hi, Dragonborn. Maybe you can stop the dragons and this war into the bargain. Um. All right. Now, if you don't mind, I've got a city to keep. Sure. But I'm gonna leave it right here right now guys. I'm actually very excited because I've never done this mission before Absurd that you uh, Normally I finish the Civil War missions the before I get this far into the storyline So I'm actually pretty freaking excited to do this, but we're gonna do it in a different video Absurd though because I want it to be dedicated But if you enjoyed this video do me a huge huge favor drop a like on this video Also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow So with that being said definitely catch you guys in the next one Deuces.